Hey guys, Shad Juice here. Here's all the 2013 open supers. It's time for my little review on uh, what I think the best and worst supers of the year were. Uh, I did this video for you guys. I mean, I like them open too, you know, but really want to do kind of an up close and personal super video with all the ones from the year opened. Uh, it was a tough uh, feat to match. Uh, I did uh, open and carded full treasure hunt sets, supers and regulars for this year, and it took a while. Took a lot of trading and hunting, but I finally got it done. And I hope you guys enjoy. And let's get started with start you off with what I think was my least favorite super of the year. And it's gonna be have to be the Ford Ranchero. I don't know, I just don't like the color scheme. The wheels look real small in it. I mean, look at the big wheel wells and look how small that wheel is. I don't know. I mean, I like the El Camino, but I just, just fell flat for me, guys. So, that's my least favorite of the year. My second least favorite is actually a casting I really enjoy, but maybe it's the purple. 64 Buick Riviera. Not a big fan of this one either. I tell you what, I got a couple extra this year, and they were hard to hard to trade. Nobody wanted them. Uh, so these are my least two favorite. Now, I got a top five, but the numbers between like six and thirteen. I'm just gonna show you, you know, the middle cars. Uh, I can't really put a number on them. There were so many good supers this year. This is really hard to do, guys. I'll give you my you no, know, my bottom two and my top five, but all these are just gonna be in the middle. So in no particular order. Here we go. Got the uh, Corvette ZR1. It's a really nice Spectra Flame Red on it. Tires are okay. I mean, the tires match the uh, stripes. The stripe real good. Or not, I don't know. Tires are kind of cheapy. But I'm gonna put that in the middle. Next, we'll put the Dodge Demon in there. Really nice casting. Just not in my top five. Next, we're going to go with 69 Camaro Convertible, which was a repeat from uh, 2012, which Mattel has a way of repeating Supers year after year. And there's got to be two Mustangs, two Camaros, and two Corvettes, seems like. Which I like all them castings, but you know, we need some var variety out there. There's plenty of cars to choose for Supers. How about some Ferraris? Yeah, we had one in 2012, but how about a Lamborghini? Anything. I mean, it's still a nice car. Real nice car. Next, we got the Bone Shaker in pink. Now, this is one I never could find on the pegs. I had to trade for the carded one and, the and one to open. Never could find that on the pegs. Um, the ones I just got done showing you, I did find on the pegs. There's a couple this year I couldn't find. I'll show you when I get to them. And this is a real sharp casting. Everybody loves bone shakers. Just not the top five this year. Next we got the uh, 72 Grand Trainer Sport which I'm a Torino collector, as you guys may know. I really like this one. The k and Air Filter logo on it. I was able to find this. I found uh, three of them at Walgreens, I think, last year in the shippers, when they had good shippers, because this year it was horrible. So, really love that casting, just not top five for me. Next, we got the Super Tundra. 
which I love it. Love the red. Love the big real rider wheels. Love the deco on there. Real sharp truck. I, I love that they do these trucks it's for supers. I'd love to see a super fire eater. You know, I know there was one a couple years ago. Yeah, I know. That red one, but I love it. Um, and here is the Falcon XB in gold. This was one of the first Supers I found for 2013. Found it in the dump bin last year before uh, the manager at my Walmart started holding the Hot Wheels for somebody else. That's all right. I still find mine, mine other places. It's a real nice casting. It also was another repeat from 2012, but still short far. Okay, and then we got the 62 vet. I'll put. I'll say this is my number six car. I really like this. I love this old vet. What do you guys think of that one? Pretty sharp. And now for my top five supers from 2013. And right off the bat, we're going to go with the 07 Ford Mustang. I'm a sucker for green cars. I'm a sucker for Mustangs. And I just had both. I really love this car. The rims are awesome. Really like they have some tail lights back there. Never know, I might do that myself. But yeah, this this will be a uh, number five. Number four, we're gonna go with the Toyota 2000 GT. I'm not the biggest JDM fan in the world, but man. This is one sweet car. Really love the red on here, the wheels, everything about it, just the way the car looks. It's just like classy, man. I don't know. Classy and sporty. I love it. So that's going to be my number four of the year. Number three. We're gonna go with the uh, Mustang Super Snake. Love the gold wheels on this car. This is a sweet ride. Sucks I had to put two Mustangs in my top five, but man, I, you know, like I said, it's that green and the gold wheels that pop like that. It's a bad boy. All right, we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Uh, if you guys are adding and subtracting what if uh, supers I've got left, you probably realize which two are left. But uh, might have a difference of opinion, but I'm making this number two. Got the '67 Camaro Summit Super, the opening hood, the S on the top. I mean, this is a bad car, man. All metal. One of the hardest ones to find. I was lucky to find a couple and was traded one. But this is number two. It's a hard decision. This one's number two. And my number one casting, Super for 2013, is the El Camino. I just love this man. 71 El Camino. The gold wheels, and the goldest brown paint. You know, it's got three different shades of like brown and tan right there on the hood. So it's just a very sweet car, man. I found I found six of these in a shipper this year. It was crazy. Like I've never found six super that was the most supers I found in one time. It was super lucky, you know. I gave it back at the end of the year. I went through two five five hundred seventy six shippers 
I didn't get one super out of either one of them, so I guess it works out in the end. But this is going to be my number one super of the year. Uh, let me know what you guys think. How do you rank the cars for the year? You can do. You can make your own list if you want in the comments. That'd be cool. Do you agree with my number one? Disagree? What do you think of my worst picks for the year? This was a hard choice for me, but I went with the El Camino because I loved it. I love both these cars. But let me know what you guys think. I appreciate all the support and everybody that watches my videos. And I hope you enjoyed this. And like I said, uh, really wanted to make this open super video for you guys. So thanks for always watching. Later.